Um, okay, so I have been a labor and delivery nurse um, since 2010, and there are different pathways as you all, I'm assuming, are familiar with the different pathways. Yep. Okay, getting nods. So I, after having my babies, went to um, just per diem shifts, so I didn't um, get all of my clinical hours in the previous um, five years, I think three years, I needed to have this um, specific amount of hours. Um, so I independently, while looking into the program, reached out to my um, coworkers and um, local resources with lactation in the area. I'm in McMinnville, so about an hour south of Portland. And the places I wanted to get some hours or spoke with to see if they would take on um, just like a one-on-one -on -one mentorship. Um, they, everybody is pretty much hands down there. Like we are contracted with the um, OHSU PSU lactation program for their clinicals. And so that's where we get our students. That's how we um, match up. And so if you want to get experience here, we highly suggest going through the program which um, pretty much sealed the deal for me. It was a pretty easy decision to have the, not only the um, support network for going through the steps, um, because it, it does seem a little bit confusing until it's clarified and simplified down to make sure all the requirements are met. Um, but also the, ability to be it's okay it's okay um the ability to be in the sites that I would want to be at and get the experience that I wanted to be at would was what um I knew I needed help with um also with the clinical experience so right now I'm in at Salem Hospital and I'm their first lactation clinical student through the program um and so we're all kind of working it out together um and that was a context that I had made prior to um, starting any clinicals with the program. Um, and so having conversations with them, um, Michelle was able to make that happen, which was really helpful because with just the one-on-one -on -one communication, um, there's less, not necessarily accountability, but they don't have to call back just like a random individual because they're like, well, you know, we'll get back to it and they're busy, but um, having, this start date and this um, student is interested and this is our program and these are our requirements. Um, that was really helpful for them to help set that up because I didn't have that all of that information to give over and set up. So that was helpful there. Um, 